there is uh, there will be huge focus on uh, continuing to grow inside India itself. But from a product development point of view, the capabilities which were built over the last few years in terms of our content media and tech capabilities, uh, we think it's very also it's also important to create products which can be taken to international markets. So initial markets which we've identified are uh, the English speaking markets, US, UK, as well as the other Commonwealth countries. So we've just started making products for the same segment in, in those uh, in those countries. So we're uh, we're bringing in some of the uh, the top most celebrity teachers from those countries and they will come and uh, uh, do the delivery part in, in our uh, educational movies. I, I think it's a function of a solid uh, revenue and profitable model. The, the business in India is already profitable. Uh, it's 100% uh, it's our revenue. The product is, uh, so we're not sharing our revenue with any of, the, any of our partners. Uh, starting from scratch, the, the product is completely made in-house which makes it uh, uh, and the fact that we've been able to acquire students, the first sale, uh, when, when, when the students come onto the annual subscription model, the first one itself is making it profitable and uh, very high renewal rates of more than 90 percentage makes it even more attractive. So the business is built on a solid foundation because we didn't, uh, uh, before we launching the product, it's, it's, also, it's important to have enough products uh, so that you can have a good amount of marketing spent. Uh, it's like if you have uh, 10 different products uh, which can be taken to the market, Th that brings down your uh, cost of acquisition by one tenth. Right. So having enough products in the portfolio, uh, starting from grade 4 up to grade 12 across multiple subjects is helping us to keep the acquisition cost very low. And this I think is, uh, and the, the fact that uh, uh, we are creating a new segment and uh, have been able to have uh, very high conversion rates on our uh, downloads. Uh, have excited uh, multiple investors, especially those who know the segment well. I think if, if I was talking about the segment, uh, previously uh, most of the companies, even though this is not a new segment as such, education is, a, is, is, is obviously a core segment. The tech and data is yet to make its real intervention in the segment. Uh, students are slowly warming up to the idea of uh, learning online, but again if the focus uh, I believe has to be on uh, education first and tech as an enabler, then uh, you will be able to make uh, a big impact in terms of how the students are adopting uh, tech-enabled learning. Yeah, it's, it's about still if you are thinking about is there a huge market for online learning uh, and in India it's like in terms of especially th there are challenges around uh, uh, the infrastructure both in terms of uh, the how the students can consume content uh, because online as such uh, is still uh, in its early stage if you if you go out of the metros so it's important to have a hybrid model where uh, students can consume most of the data offline with uh, online being used for uh, data as well as uh, reports and assessments